Hey everyone, I wanted to come and show you my new love spell dupe. I'm calling it Love Rising. Isn't that adorable? Still gotta smooth them up and do the edges and everything. But, uh, I'm really happy with it. Very cute. For those that have never smelled the love spell, it's very bright, sweet, and citrusy. I like it. It's one of my favorites. <clears throat> Actually, it was uh, Christine who got me hooked on it. Hers was the first time I'd ever smelled it. When we did our swap way back when. <laughs> and I've always wanted to soap it ever since then. I'm so glad it did. It soaps great. Uh, so, there we go. Oh, look at the update on the uh, chocolate soaps. Look how dark they got. Don't they look fabulous? So I've got um, more batches of those coming up, and I'll get those listed on the site soon. Right now they still, they, they smell good, but they still have that, that cocoa scent to them that's hopefully fading just a smidge, because it's kind of a bitter cocoa, but it's so good with the dark chocolate scents. Yum. And let's see, update on... These came out so cool. This is the water lily. Look how pretty that came out. I love that. And the Nog Champa is now officially olive green. <laughs> oh, but it smells good. <laughs> Anyhow, um, I wanted to also bring up, I have now added a multi-pack two multi-packs to the website for the soaps. It is three for fifteen and that saves you three dollars or four for twenty-four and get one free and that saves you six bucks. So those are now available. You just leave a note at your checkout on which ones that you want. Obviously it'll be whatever I have listed on the site you choose from those. Market's doing well. Um, we still don't have electricity up yet, so I still haven't been able to stream video. But um, they keep saying it's coming soon, so hopefully. <laughs> very soon, very soon. Oh, and I wanted to do a quick reminder. Um, the shipping estimator on my website is not always the greatest. Most times I try to set it where... I, you know, eat a little bit of the shipping, but sometimes it goes a little wonky and you guys end up paying more on shipping. If I can fit it in a flat rate envelope or a smaller box, I absolutely will, and I refund all shipping overages, like immediately, okay? So if you ever do like a pop-up shipping estimator, and you know you bought like, you know, six soaps and it's saying it needs to go into a box, I'll get it into an envelope and refund that money. Okay, guys? Now I'll catch you later. Okay, bye.